Okay, so today I'm gonna try to see how much of the front end I can get cut up so that we can remove the engine later and maybe cut up some of the back to make the wheel, clear the wheel out so we can push it out of the garage when we're done. So here's the problem I'm running into. The uh, fan is so far mushed into the radiator that I can't get to uh, the lower radiator hose to get it out. And then the fan itself is wedged behind all of this radiator goodness. So I'm hoping if I can get the uh, fan out, I should be able to get the radiator out enough that I can get that uh, screw off so I can Pull the rest of it out and I'd like to salvage that bottom radiator hose. It doesn't seem to be broken or busted. Ah, it's getting a drain pan. And there you go. Now the radiator's out, you can kind of see how smushed in everything is. Hoping to cut out some bits to make removing the engine a little bit easier. We shall see. Sitting back here, so I figure I might as well uh, cut some of that out. Don't worry, there's a jack stand underneath there. Apparently I have the guest. Bye, puppy. Or oh, you're coming back, puppy. Don't let the coolant, puppy.
thank you, me, for labeling everything. Okay, so we're done for the day. Um, don't know if you can see, but uh, where there should be a motor mount is not much of a motor mount at all anymore. Man, that's really dark. Uh, and over here, we've got a pretty well cut off motor mount. So this engine's barely hanging in there. Uh, stripped everything off the intake manifold, most of the wiring's out. I've unplugged most things. So we should be basically ready to pull this thing soon. Shouldn't be too bad. All right, catch you next time.